FetLife's pretty cool, but one of the problems with FetLife is that all of the data inside of FetLife has to stay in FetLife. They don't offer any way to move data outside of FetLife, such as events to your calendar. Um, it would be pretty neat if I could just take this event and put it on my calendar in one click. Well, I figure it's time to start making FetLife better, so that's what I've done. I'm going to show you how to use a user script and Firefox to move data from event pages out into your calendar with very, very, very simple uh, operations. We're going to need a couple things to do that. First, using Firefox, we're going to go to our add-ons manager and we're going to go get a couple of the tools we'll need to do this. In this case, we're going to use something called Grease Monkey, which is an extension we can just search for and install just like this. And we're also going to look for the operator extension, which is a tool that lets you uh, grab semantic information from pages, little metadata bits, and move it to your browser. We're going to go ahead and restart that as Firefox asks us to do. Now, what I did is I wrote a little user script. So once we have these two uh, add-ons installed, go to maybemame.com slash playground slash better dash fetlife dash user script. That'll take you to this page. It's a bit sparse right now, but click on a user script to enhance fetlife.com and that'll take you to userscripts.org with an install button. Click on install and what you'll get is a Grease Monkey script. That'll go ahead and install. Click on install to do that, obviously. Just make sure that you want to trust me. And once that's installed, there we go, installed successfully. We can now go back to FetLife and we'll reload this page. And what you'll see is Operator has added a little plus button here. This plus button now gives you an event, and that's the metadata from this event first Android Aperture Meetup East Bay. You can do a couple things to it. I'm going to just hit export here and then I'll take it right into my calendar. It'll ask me where I want to put it. I'll just take a new calendar and we can say bang, there we go, new calendar and here's my event information right from FetLife.com. Now this script is still very very new. This is the only thing it does so far but I'd like to start making it better so that FetLife's data doesn't stay inside of FetLife because your data that you put there is yours, not FetLife's. Thanks, help me out.